This preview of Welcome to the Family is sponsored by... So we went to the Children's Coalition and I thought that maybe we could develop a good partnership with them. So right now we're at the Child Rescue Coalition. Basically they're going to be bringing in a bunch of speakers today. One in seven boys will be sexually abused before the age 18. And even worse than that, one in four girls will be sexually abused before the age of 18. These are horrible facts of how many children are being abused annually. Over 300,000 children just in the U.S. I'm going to start this map here as I speak, and you're immediately going to start seeing dots populate the map, okay? They have software that helps track predators. These are computers that are online right this minute, right this second, that are participating in this child pornography cloud that I described a moment ago. Because it went from the guys who roamed the streets and surfed behind buses to grab children to the internet, which became the private hunting ground for pedophiles all over the world. In three weeks, we're able to arrest 77 pedophiles. They recovered five children alive under the age of 12 that were being actively molested and involved in child pornography. Police have been able to make over 4,000 arrests. And I thought, you know, this is something that we should align with motivational missionaries considering that we're both helping children. If you're involved in this activity, I am going to hunt you down, I am going to put you in jail, and I'm going to make sure that you don't abuse these kids anymore. So that's the message. It is an ugly, ugly little secret that Americans don't want to admit that we engage in. We don't want to admit that it's a problem. We know it's interesting. Our kids are brought up to learn uh, don't drink and drive, yes. don't do drugs. There's got to be another mantra coming from our parents and our schools. Think before you post. I had no idea that the predators are actually breaking into the apps and stealing the pictures and videos and stuff from the kids before they're even deleted. For example, in Snapchat, all the kids think the picture disappears instantly. It doesn't because by pushing two buttons on your phone, you can capture it, put it in your phone, or repost it anywhere you want. And unfortunately, we all have a friend that doesn't respect privacy very well somewhere in our lives. They take that picture, they repost it onto Twitter, onto Facebook, onto Instagram. What I think children need to realize now and parents need to focus on is to stay away from anybody on the internet that you really do not know. If people around the country and really around the world understood the, the gravity, the scope of this problem, I think we would see a groundswell. If you think that it can't happen to your child in America, it can happen to your child. In America, the richest, most powerful country on this planet is the number one offender in of sex trafficking of children and human trafficking of adults. All new episodes of Welcome to the Family, airing at 6 p.m. Eastern, only on www.boa.tv.